off to go get some coffee before class. Gotta love Friday classes, people. Don't take one if you don't have to. Got the goods. Also, guys, I used to always get a croissant in the morning from Starbucks, but I've recently been getting the Everything Bantam Bagels. Get them if you've never tried them. Honestly, they're underrated. They're so good. So easy to eat before class or like during class. So yeah, try Everything Bantam Bagels if you have it. And if you like Everything Bagels and vegetable cream cheese like I do, you'll probably love them like me. So yeah, off to class. Campus is literally dead because no one has Friday classes. No one does it to themselves. Unfortunately, this semester, I did it to myself. Hey guys, so I just got back from my Friday class. We all know how I feel about my 53 minute class on a Friday. Not particularly something I want to be going to, but it wasn't that bad hiking to main campus today because I did wind up grabbing some lunch with some of my sorority sisters, so it was like worth it to be on main campus. But I'm back now and it's around 1.30. It's Friday, so that means Harris is picking me up. He usually picks me up around like 5, 5.30, so like I have um, a good chunk of time to get some stuff done. Also, welcome to the weekend vlog. I should probably preface it. This is the start of the weekend vlog. I am going home tonight, like I said. I don't really know what me and Harris have planned, but I'll be back on main campus tomorrow because one of my roommate's boyfriends is coming to visit. He goes to school in Connecticut, and we have like a night out planned. So I'll be back for that, but as for today, in between now and when Harris gets me, I have some work to do. I have to read for my psychology prediction class. We have to read a memoir for that class, and it's called Tweak. And it is a very good book. If you guys know the movie A Beautiful Boy, the main character, this is kind of his side of things, whereas A Beautiful Boy is his dad's side of things. But this is his side. It's very good and very interested. If you guys think it's something you'd be interested in reading, I can link it down below for you guys to check it out. So I have to read that. Also, my room is still not cleaned from last week, so I'm going to straighten that up. I have to get all my laundry together because I plan on doing laundry this weekend because I want to film a college outfits of the week video this week, so I need, like, clean clothes to, like, put outfits together, you guys know. So I have to do that, but other than that, I don't know what Harris and I are doing. Probably, you know, the usual dinner, dessert, movie, hangout, I don't really know. Like I always say, it'll be a surprise for you and it'll be a surprise for me. But I hope you guys enjoy this video. I hope you guys enjoy my weekend vlogs. These are honestly some of my favorite videos to film. And I just hope you guys are enjoying them also. So before I ramble on any longer, I don't want to procrastinate. I have a lot to get done. I'm going to go read and try and get as much done as I can in this time. And I, of course, will check in with you guys once that all is done. So yes, I'll be back. Worst part about going home carrying all my stuff. I have all my laundry, also changed in my crop hoodie. But this is always the worst part. And I only live on the second floor, but it's not fun. Oh, no. Came to Target. What are we getting in Target? Masks. Face masks, as I chew my gum. Yeah, these are face masks, babe. These aren't the same ones we had, though. No, it's just a different brand. I really want to get... I want to get you this one. Read it and tell me what you think. Read it. Candy population. Candy population. Candy population. Oh, anti... <laughs> You say anti-population? Pollution. No, this one's so cool. If you've ever done this mask, you know what I'm talking about. It feels so cool on your face. Yeah, there's like a whole bunch. It's our new kick, face masks. Okay, so we went with ultra hydrating for Harris and brightening for me, the bubble masks. These are so cool. Just wait. Just wait till you see how cool these are on your skin. And then we also got black hair remover. Is that all we need from here? Ew, I'm like chewing my gum so annoying in the background. I'm so sorry, guys. So we just left Target. We picked up our face masks. Now we are leaving Stony Brook. We probably have like, I don't know, like 45 minutes to an hour until we'll be back. We have dinner reservations at the same Japanese restaurant that we went to in my last weekend video. We just 
love Japanese food. But tonight I think I'm going to branch out and actually try like sushi that has actual fish in it. <laughs> like not just an avocado roll. I think I've had it before like with my grandpa but I don't know exactly what it was. So I'm nervous. But I think I'll like it. So I'll keep you guys updated for that. Also this lighting is horrible but whatever. So yeah I will update you guys once we are back. Looks is in the bathroom. What happened to how to train your bed? What if I don't? I guess not final verdict because I only had a spicy tuna roll. It's not bad. It's harder to eat than an avocado roll because it is bigger. I feel like I just have a small mouth. I don't know. It was hard to eat. It really wasn't bad. It didn't taste bad. The consistency wasn't what I thought because... Are you going to pick that up right now? Nope. Um, I had sushi once with Harris when we were in Disney and I don't know what it was, but I almost vomited. I didn't like it. So that's why I was nervous, but this wasn't bad. The consistency wasn't bad, the taste wasn't bad, it wasn't bad. There's a lot going on right now. Your phone ringing, are you gonna end it? Or do they have to listen to that? Okay, it's done. There's an ambulance. Now we're gonna go get dessert. We were gonna get frozen yogurt, but I don't think that's the move anymore. Is it? I don't know, I don't know what the move is. But I need dessert. Harris got me on this thing where like, we always eat dessert after we eat. I really used to not be that way, but then like, he's that way, so now I'm that way. So I don't really know. I guess I'll let you guys know when I decide what we're doing for the night instead of like froyo. So Harris is getting Sour Patch Kids and Fruit Mentos. I was gonna go with pretzel M&Ms, but then I see these white chocolate peanut M&Ms. I think this is what I'm gonna go with. We're just going with candy for the night. But these, these look good. All right guys, so I just got out of the shower. As you guys can see, my hair is soaking wet. But anyway, I got out of the shower. I'm going to head downstairs and quickly throw some laundry in. Like I said, I brought all my laundry home, so I have to go throw that in and get that started. And then once that's done, Harris and I are gonna do our face masks. I am so excited. Last weekend, I gave him just like a plain sheet mask to do and he thought it was the coolest thing ever. So I bought the ones, as you guys saw, like the ones that look like a plain sheet mask, but then they start like bubbling up and fizzing on your face. I've never done one of these either. One of my roommates did it once and it was honestly the coolest looking thing ever. So I'm excited for me, but I'm also excited to see his reaction of it on his face and like fizzing up. So yes, I'm going to go through my laundry room, then we're going to do our face masks and I'm going to of course film it because I think it's going to be the funniest thing ever. I think we're going to look funny and I also just want his reaction. Also, we did just get candy from 7-Eleven and we decided on, I think, watching Black Swan. Surprisingly enough, the movie lovers that we are, neither of us have seen Black Swan. So I think that's what we've decided on. It was between Black Swan and How to Train Your Dragon 1 and 2. But I think we're going with Black Swan. This is a good look for me. <laughs> I actually look like um, a victim of something, like... Someone will rip my face off and eat my face. <laughs> you just look like an animal. I look scary. Like someone literally ripped my face off and tried to murder me. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, update. It is like completely fizzing up. It burns a little bit. Just, does yours hurt or no? Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, it's burning a little bit. It's too big for my face. I look crazy. All right. Bird to the masks. I liked mine. Harris didn't really like his. You weren't a fan? No, nah, the other one was better. He didn't like it. He said he felt like it was very slimy, but I enjoyed mine. So now we're going to just get into bed and watch our movie. So I will check in with you guys in the morning. Getting stuff for the new little that I'm taking on this semester. Got a craft. Look, absolutely insane, but that's what I get for not drying my hair last night. So, what time is it? It's 3.22. Hey, I used to live in 3.22. It's 3.22, we're back at Sternberg now. Me and Howard had a very uneventful morning. We literally did nothing. We went to Michael's. I had to make up some crafts to start crafting for Big Little because I'm taking on another Little. And Big Little is in two weeks. So I got some stuff for that. We just went to 7-Eleven. Now I'm heading back to campus. I think I'm gonna be the only one home. Ashley gets home from work at four. So I don't, I don't think I'll be at home alone for very long. But yes, I don't really know what we're doing until we go out tonight. I'm sure, I think we're actually gonna order food. I think we might order California Pizza Kitchen, but keep you guys updated. Oh yeah. All right guys, so I'm back in my room now. I've honestly been home for a few hours. I think I got home around like four and it's like seven now. Me and my roommates did wind up ordering California Pizza Kitchen and it was so good. I haven't had that in so long and it honestly was really good. Even like door dashed, it was pretty good. And I still have like half my pie left that I'll probably eat when I get home tonight. So yeah, my roommate Ashley just left to go pick up her boyfriend and two of his friends. They'll be back shortly and we're all going to hang out here before we go out. But I need to sit down and do my makeup. Also need to do something with this hair because it looks a little crazy. I also have no idea what I want to wear. I feel like I have no going out clothes and I just wear the same three outfits. So I definitely need to go shopping soon, but hopefully I can find something or borrow something from one of my roommates. I don't really know. I'm going to do my makeup and hope it sparks an idea for an outfit. So I'm going to go do that and then I'll check in with you guys and hopefully I'll have something picked out because it's like 7 now. I think Ashley said they should be back around 9. She was like going to hang out with her boyfriend and then they were going to get his friends and then come here. And then we're going to hang out before we go out and then we'll probably won't go out to like 10.30ish, maybe 11. I don't really know. I'll keep you guys updated with all those plans and everything, but I'm going to go and try and get myself together a little bit. Alright guys, this lighting is horrible but that's dorm lighting for you so i did my makeup nothing crazy honestly eyeshadow eyebrows bronzer highlighter i will do my lip but i will figure that out once i'm dressed i also did my hair i just like loosely curled it with my straightener like i always do i always use my straightener to curl my hair so it's almost nine o'clock so i have to go clean up all my stuff in the common room because i do my makeup in the common room or like the living room then i have to figure out what i want to wear still as far as i got is jeans so that's not great but i'm gonna go do all that i'm gonna get dressed i'm sure people will start showing up soon because we told everyone like 9 9 30 i'll show you guys my outfit once it's all on so yeah i should probably go look for something everybody it is now sunday and it's not so much morning it's like 1 30 ish i would say i had a late start to my day we got home pretty late last night last night wound up being a really fun night it was kind of annoying before we went out because stony brook housing and residents are annoying and they like to give us you know some trouble so that was a little annoying that's why i didn't really film that much was people over we were kind of annoyed long story but we went out and we made the best of it it honestly was a really fun night i got home pretty late probably around 2 30 so i did sleep in today 
but I'm up now. Also, do you guys like my sick outfit I have going on? You know, this is what it is. But yes, I'm sitting down now to do some work. I have to shower. I also have a meeting tonight, so I am going to end the video now just because I don't think the footage I would get today would be very entertaining. So I'm just going to end it now. I also want to remind you guys that I'm not going to be uploading on Wednesday. My next video will be up on Friday because I'm filming a outfits of the week, a college outfits of the week. So I need the whole week to do that. So I hope you guys enjoyed this weekend vlog. And if you did, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Like I always say, head on down there and subscribe if you haven't already. I always appreciate all the love and support I can get. And with that being said, I will see you guys on Friday in my next video. Bye, guys. Say